I know I don't normally start the videos out this way, but this loot crate came with a rubber band, and it's not the reason why it isn't in the book. I, I have I have no idea what to do with this. It's it's a rubber band. Welcome, it's January and it's time to do another Loot Crate video with me, I'm Mike. We're gonna start the way we normally do with Loot Crates with the pin. Now they've, they're doing something different, it's January, it's a new year. This pin is on a big thing. It's on a big thing. These pins unlock things now. This pin gives you a free issue of a comic that you could download off of Comixology. Okay, I guess that's kinda neat other than just a pin. I don't know how it unlocks it though. I'll look into that later. Next, as always, we have a magazine. Uh, so this theme is Invasion. And that's kind of cool because it's all about X-Files, basically. X-Files is coming on soon. Uh, so this one's all aliens, and apparently their New Year's resolution is to take uh, a page out of Geek Fuel and put a t-shirt in every box. That's kind of neat, I guess. So this one has a t-shirt in it. If you want to pause it, this is the Mega Crate. Actually, I kind of wanted this one, but only because of that stupid Admiral Akbar figure. I don't know why I do collect Star Wars figures. I have a problem. All right, moving on, let's get into the crate. Uh, number one, we have these prints. Prints, the, not like the artist formerly known as prints. 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 It's fun to say, prints. Mini prints, they're pretty thick cardboard. We have War of the Worlds, a classic. And the day the earth stood still. Another classic. Can't go wrong with that. Moving along, we have batteries. Because you get an X-Files branded flashlight. LED flashlight with Loot Crate logo. Actually, yeah, it does say the X-Files on it. I mean, it's a, it's a flashlight. I guess you can't have too many flashlights, right? And it's kind of cool they give you batteries. Although, I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to mail batteries. Is that right? I think that sounds right, but I don't know enough about mail law to refute it. It's a multi-pass, so I could do that whole thing from Fifth Element if I want to. This looks like something you get from a dollar store. Exclusive plastic card sleeve. Fun. I don't know why this is Invasion. I guess Fifth Element is invasion -y. Next, we have mini alien vinyl figures from uh, Space Invaders. Let's go ahead and pop this open. There's just there's just the one in here. There we go. Let's get that right in there. That's kind of neat. Have a Space Invader figure. I mean, it'll look good sitting on a desk. Next, we have, seriously, let me, let me open this. Ooh, it's soft. We have, from Kid Robot, the world's cutest face hugger. Look, look at that face. Who wouldn't want to hug that face? The thing's adorable. He's like, hey, hug me. Hug me. It's really freaking cute. And he's really soft. I don't have a plush collection. It's cool though. And last, it's soft. Pwah! This is, it's an X-Files t-shirt. It's X-Files. And it's a t-shirt. And I'm wearing it. And... Nips. It's hard to see on the black though. I just wanted to do it. New t-shirts are always welcome. That's kind of cool. Does it, glow in, does it glow in the dark? It does not. It doesn't glow, it doesn't glow in the dark. It'd be kind of cool if it did. That's been all for this month's Loot Crate, January 2016. This has been Invasion. Uh, thanks for watching. If you made it this far, if you didn't, you, did, you didn't and you, you're not listening to this. Cool, that's cool too. Uh, anyway, bye.